here in LA proves that graffiti is still very much a big part of Los Angeles and that the talent has gotten more diverse and actually more skilled and uh, younger. Cool. What do you think about graffiti and the internet? Has that changed the way inter I mean, the graffiti scene now? Well, yeah, I helped create that, you know, so I was really surprised. Well, actually not surprised because when I started back in the early 90s the, on the net, people introducing people to the net, the first people that really gravitated toward it were the, the writers. It wasn't the companies, the corporations. They were like, yo, what's this laptop? What's this animation? What's this graffiti stuff? What's hip hop on the net? And so now that we found another platform, it's a lot like just the subway system, basically. You know, it's just going from stop to stop different layup to layup and everybody's got something to show so in that way it's an important part of the development of graffiti and, and just the, the culture in general. Cool. Mayor 139, ROC, CIA, TDS, TKA. I'm um, doing this piece right now for Temp 1, doing a little burner for him, in memory of him and his work. I'm a sculptor but I like, you know, for me to come back and do a piece for him is especially good since I don't really paint. I'm sorry. So big shout out to Gorilla One. You keep it on the net. Yeah, this guy is old school. Ten. He's old school, dog. Uh, I, he's old school. <laughs> and it shows. <laughs>